In this problem, we will illustrate calculation of packing fraction in face centered cubic unit cell. So this is face centered lattice. Each corner atom is a lattice point. So we have eight corner. So we have eight lattice point. Along with corner atom, all faces are also lattice point. So in case of face centered, we have lattice points or corner atom and face centered. That is corner plus face centered. So we will place atom at these lattice points. So if I place atoms at these lattice points, we will have this a space filling model. This is this atom is on this corner and we have one atom on this corner, one atom on this corner, we have one atom on this corner, we also have one atom on the face. So this is a space filling model of FCC lattice that is face centered cubic. Now if I make a cross section that is effective number of atom that is inside this cubic unit cell this will look something like this. So we have 1 by 8 part of this atom, corner atom lying in this unit cell and half of the face atom lying in this unit cell. So basically from corner atom we have 1 by 8 contribution. From face atom we have half contribution. So we can calculate total number of atom inside this unit cell. that is Z effective. So we have 8 corner atom contribution is 1 by 8 plus 6 face atom contribution is half. So this is 1 plus 3. So we have total effectively 4 atom. Now let us find volume. Volume of unit cell. If I assume as length of this unit cell is A. So this length is A or we can say this length is A. So this length to this length, this length is A. So from here to here, this length is A. So volume of unit cell is A cube because this is a cube. If this length is A, this length has to be A. Similarly, this length will also be A because this is a cube. So volume is A cube. Now we can find volume of atom. Volume of atom inside unit cell. So we have two atom and the volume of one atom is 4 by 3 pi r cube. Now we need one relation between A and R. That is edge length and radius of atom. We can see from here atom touches along the face. So atom are touching along the face. This is the center of the middle atom. This is the center of this atom corner one this is center of this corner one. So this distance is R because there we have atom. This distance is R. This distance is also R. This distance is also R. This distance is R. So we can say face diagonal is 4 R. So face diagonal is equals to 4 R. We can also find face diagonal in terms of A this length is A, this length is A, now this angle is 90 degree, so this is A square plus A square under root, so this length is under root 2A. So we can write relationship under root 2A is equals to 4R, that is 
a is equals to 2 root 2 r now let us find percentage packing fraction that is volume of a term divided by total volume so volume of a term is 8 by 3 that is 4 into 2 pi r q divided by total volume is a q into 100 so this is equals to 8 pi r q divided by a q and a is 2 root 2 into 100 and here we also have 3 so this is 8 pi r q and this is 3 2 into 2 into 8 and this 2 is 2 root 2 into r q into 100 so we will have r q cancel 8 cancel so we will have pi divided by 6 root 2 into 100 basically we have done one mistake this is effective atom is 4 so this should be 4 this is not 2 effectively we have 4 atom so this is 4 into 4 by 3 pi r q so here we will have 4 into 4 by 3 that is 16 by 3 so everywhere I have to have 16 so this number is 16 now this is 16 by 8 so this will become 2 so 2 pi by 6 root 2 now let us calculate this value we will have so pi divided by so we have 2 into pi 2 into pi divided by 6 square root 2 so this value is 0.74 so in percentage we can write 74 percent so in case of face centered unit cell percentage packing fraction is 74 percent in simple cubic if you remember this is only 52 percent percentage packing fraction in simple cubic is only 52 percent so this means FCC packing is more packed compared to simple cubic packing and this is logical because in this case you see effectively we have four atom so more atom more the packing fraction